Peter. As you can see, these cassava plants are alive and quite hardy, but grow too slowly for food production. We want to hybridize them with a more productive variety and would welcome your help. Cassava plants growing too slowly, huh? Better head to ESU. A professor there just discovered a new variety that grows impressively fast. They'd make a great hybrid. Their rare variety of the Asian cassava plant grows like crazy. And I'll only need a single leaf to splice with ours. The professor is always looking for practical applications. She'll be super into doing a collab. Oh no. No. Someone stole the cassava? I've got to track down the thieves before they get too far. Maybe there are some traces of pollen still in the air. Got it. Glad this plant is a wind pollinator. It releases so much pollen, I can see the path they took. Now let's see where these pilfering plants are at. Good thing this pollen isn't triggering my allergies. Achoo! Total coincidence. I refuse to be allergic. Exactly. Maybe that it could be used to make untraceable points. All I know is he was more than willing to pay. Definitely not trying to feed their community. Oh, you're like a little seed in there. Better hope I don't get to him. Let's squash that spider and flush him. Where's that plant? Couldn't have walked far. All right, buddy. One quick stop at feast, and then we'll get you back home. Glad we nipped this nefarious plant in the bud. See what I did there? Yeah, I knew you would. Wait, your name's not Audrey, is it? Parker, stop talking to the plant! <laughs> okay, now to borrow a bit of your super special genetic material to help your cousins grow faster. Okay, so we want some extra growth genes from our guest plant. There he is! Huh? Oh no, you're not touching that! That plant must be really special to you! It did that machine thingy! Two weeks! Spider-Man thinks he's so smart. Did I say that? We just followed you straight back here. You're pretty dumb. <laughs> Let's try that again. How do these fit together? This should create a cassava that grows more quickly without sacrificing the yield. This is some cutting-edge splicing tech they've developed. Makes it possible to meet food supply challenges without sacrificing safety and transparency. There we go. 
The plant will be secure in this workbench until ESU can buff up their greenhouse security. Feast will really be able to improve their crop yield with these new hybrids.